Listen, I, I don't like shitting in the public. Oh my God, that's, you're one of those. Why are there so many no, men no, that I, hate that shitting shit in is, public? That shit is goofy, nigga. Goofy. They have to wait until they get home to poop. I can't. Not I even can't, in an airport. I don't like, listen. School, listen, work. I, I feel like I can't shit at my highest potential when I'm not at home. So you're just going to be fucking miserable. No, no. There, there are exceptions where you got to shit. Sometimes you got to hit them with the, the hover squat. Sometimes you just got to hit it with the hover squat. All right? But, no, I need to be comfortable. I need to be comfortable. <laughs> so you'll hold this shit all day. No, no I'll, I'll try and get the fuck home. You just get to work. Bro. What you doing? Ooh, that's a tough scenario. I just I just walked in. I just and, walked in. And bubble guts. I'm going hey, I'm to I'm I'm hit him with the, hey, bro, I got to go back home, bro. I go back Why? Home. Cause I need to. If I'm a shit, I need to feel comfortable. Oh my god. A lot of people would agree with me. Weird. Like a lot of people would agree with There's me. There's restrooms everywhere. Just get over it. Yes, but it's not. Just it's kidding. a comfortability thing. Comfortability, but okay. What do you do when you go out of town? What do you mean at a hotel? Yeah. It's, that's different. So that's like your. That's yeah. okay. You can shit in a hotel. Like in your room, yeah, that's that's but fine. Nowhere, but nowhere, like, nowhere else. Like in public. shitting in a public bathroom. Oh my goodness, worst nightmare, worst fucking nightmare. Why? Bro, I, I don't know. I don't know who was sitting there last. One of th one thing about me too is like if I'm shitting in a public bathroom. Jesus. Like there's a lot of men like this though. I've, I've dated a lot of men that are what, feel the same listen, way as you. If I'm shitting in the if they I I will go through every stall and find you know you know how they have the. Seat covers? Seat covers, uh -huh. right? But here's the problem with seat covers. People think you that you get the seat covers, you rip the middle, and then you just put it on. Mm -hmm. That's not what you fucking do. What you do you don't do? do that. You take one seat cover, you rip that bitch in half, and you place the sides accordingly. Okay? So I use maybe five seat covers. <laughs> right? I need at least two layers here. Single-handedly ruin, ruining the environment. The whole seat one needs to be covered. One shit at a the time. The whole seat needs to be covered. I will not sit on it if the whole seat's not covered. That middle piece, that middle piece, you know, where your junk just sits, it has to be I covered. I don't know. Uh, but for sure. Sure. But Zeke knows where the middle piece is, right? And your your it has that little opening where your junk folds right through. It has to be covered. <laughs> if if my junk touches that. Seat or that little crease, I'm cutting my dick off. Cutting my dick off. <laughs> it's not. It's not for me. It's not fucking for me. God. I'm not doing this with y'all. I'm not shitting in public. No, I'm not doing that. And God forbid I have to shit on an airplane. Oh my goodness, sweet baby Jesus. <laughs> oh my goodness. Damn. I'm out the home. Listen, I'm very. Two things about airplanes for me. I don't like to piss on airplanes because. I don't like to be up. I don't like to get the fuck up on airplanes. Mm -hmm. I don't right. like to get up at all. Right. And all that right. moving. It's too much. It's too much. It's just, <laughs> yeah, you can't handle it. Can't handle it. To then piss is fine if I really need to go. But to shit? <laughs> On an Hell airplane no. is a no-go for you? No-go. There's not enough room. You're like a small little uh, toddler cubicle. Because you're the type to get fully naked to take shit. 100%. Now, I don't do that in public bathrooms, though. Obviously. I hope not. I've seen people you who have. Are you serious? I Listen, I God is my witness. I saw, well, I don't want to say, I'm assuming, but. There was I, clothes on the floor? Yes. Yes. With the shoes off? No, the shoes were still on. Mm. But there was, there was boxers and Gotta pants. Got keep the traction. And then there was, and there was, yeah, I think that's what it was. Mm -hmm. And another thing that's irritating, man, I just have so many irritations today. Uh, locker rooms. If, if, if I see you in a locker room, right? Mm-hmm. And you you finna go shit right in the locker room and you ain't got no shoes on and your feet are just gripping that dirty ass floor. <laughs> are you shitting? That shit is disgusting. But I but my biggest thing is if, if my junk touches that seat thing, like say this is the the front end of the the this this is the toilet, mm -hmm. right? And you have the little opening. You you seen like mm -hmm. how it goes. if my shit just even touched the tip of this of the seat, like if there's the little paper there, okay, made it through. But if it touches the that shit, I gotta cut my shit off. I, I don't. I can't have no. You would hate being a woman. We have to sit for everything. So I don't want to do that shit. And if if the water splashes back into my booty hole, oh my god! Then what? It's time to die. It's time Shut to up. go. It's time to go. I feel like a lot of guys feel this that way. Like if if the if, if listen, it's like a. 
I don't know how to explain it, but if the water comes back and touches me. And what about it? I'm just like. (laughs) That shit just takes me to. I'm I'm, I'm looking at the sky and trying to understand Jesus. Why? And then I'm also trying to understand like who. What the fuck just happened? So what about it freaks you out? Just because other people have been on it. You don't know. Bro. It's dirty or something. That dirty ass water. That. Oh. So it's just the water. I don't know. And the sea. It's just, I don't want no, I don't want no dirty water just touching my butt. Just touching my booty. No. It's just a no, man. I think I saw a study that they say pillowcases are dirtier than toilets. I don't give a fuck. So. I don't give a fuck. Add that to your fear list. I don't even use pillowcases. Oh right, that's kind of, my I do. I do. god! No, I do. I do. I, I don't want to hear shit about toilets. No, listen, listen. But if guys, I know y'all agree with me too. But I, you yeah, just no. have to lay it out. I don't. I think there are a lot of men that agree with you that they can't go to the bathroom in public. Yeah, yeah. and they will hold it all day, and that's fucking weird. No, hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred percent. Because I need to feel comfortable, and your body knows. Your body. When you gotta go, you gotta go. Yes, but no. Listen, your body—it's health. It's not no. healthy to hold it in. I don't care. Your body knows when you get home. You 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 pull out that poo poo stool. Mm. Get butt ass naked. That shit just hit different. No wonder motherfuckers can sit on that motherfucker on the stool for ten hours. This shit is just relaxing. That's not healthy. It might not be healthy, but it's damn sure relaxing. After this, I'm gonna go home and probably sit on that bitch for two hours, and just be content with life. Maybe have a, a drink or two on there. Lord Jesus. That's disgusting. You need help. But that 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 water come back and touch my butt, it's over with. I'm done. Jesus. I almost invested in the in the poo poo, I think it's called poo poo softener spray. It's like a little foam you put in the toilet. The company knows. If you've seen this, send me some bottles. But you spray softener? It, you spray listen, you spray it in the in the toilet and it builds a foam. So then the the foam catches. And a soft touch. So no way water's going to splash back in your booty hole. No way. No way, no sir. It's a fucking beautiful brand. Beautiful. Fucking. F- Honestly. You need help. Elon Musk need to buy that brand. You need Jesus. And I'm telling you. It, it's like a. Therapy. Because it, it can't come back and splash in your butt. Ooh, water. See, see you don't understand, bro. I got bigger fears than that. Thank like you. Like what? I ain't here Getting, to talk about exactly. it. Exactly. But yeah, nah, I'm not doing that, man. I'm not doing that. <laughs> not water. So I feel bad when I have to get on a 12-hour flight and I have to shit. Exactly. Well, I'm going to make sure I'll shit it well, before that flight. I, I think I can go a solid two days without shit. I, I doubt it. No. All the, the shit you eat. You eat a lot of calories. Yeah, but I, I use the restroom. I, I have a bowel movement maybe twice a day. Exactly. And you think you can go two days without it? Yeah, if you prepare yourself correctly and you, 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 if I'm leaving, if I'm doing a full flight to the UK that's going to take me 11 hours, I'm going to shit well before that. I'm going to be all right. And then the any food that I'm about to eat, by the time I get there, it's going to be ready to be unloaded, just like the plane. Mm-hmm.